Now let's consider Webster's method. Use Webster's method with D equals 47.7 to apportion the doctors in the clinic. With Webster's method, we're going to take for our calculations the population and divide by the value of D, which in this case is 47.7. Were that value not given to us, we would have to use trial and error to come up with a value. Let's go ahead and do the calculations. We're going to divide 119 by 47.7 to give us 2.49. Dividing B gives us 3.46. For clinic C, division gives us 4.53. Now, with Webster's method, we're going to use typical rounding rules. And that is, when we see the 2.49, because this decimal portion is not greater than 1 half, we're going to end up rounding down to 2. For part B, for clinic B, that is, we're going to take the 0.46 and see that we have to round down to give us 3. And for clinic C, we're going to round up to give us 5. And so we see that our total is 10, which gives us the correct apportionment.